Yo, 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 what is up, everyone? I'm Solar Wolf. This is Solar Wolf Plays. Get in on the And today we are on Nimbotus. We're going to start a new game on survival. Start it on easy. Just again, it's another blind playthrough, guys. I haven't played this before, so I want to try it out. Name it Solaria, and here we go. Welcome. Oh. The desire to explore new territories is written deep down in the DNA of mankind. And so, after the conquest of the vast oceans, people found a way up to the stars. The Russian satellite Sputnik in 1957, the manned moon landing of Apollo 11 by 1969, the colonization of Mars in 2071, and the first successful travel through a wormhole in 2120 were all crucial milestones in the history of space exploration. But none of these were as promising as what lies ahead of us. The Nimbotus, the biggest mobile drone factory ever made, is finally ready to be sent out into space. With its one-of-a-kind hyperwarp drive and self-sustaining resource gathering systems, it is able to leave the safe zone within seconds. This is where you, Captain, come into play. You are tasked with commanding the Nimbotus and designing drones to explore the endless expanses of the universe so that mankind may learn from your discoveries. It's time to introduce yourself. Now, this is the heavyweight class. He tends to get things like plasma shotguns, kinetic blasters. He starts with a resource collector and resource tank. Um, we got a small magnet, energy shields, and then some basic fuel supply stuff. This is the pilot type. He also gets the resource collector stuff. As well as instead of um, the shotguns, he gets a plasma long laser. You get some spikes for buildup or whatever. Um, he gets an afterburner. We don't really need those right away. Um, he gets larger tanks, but still maintains small batteries. The engineer or miner gets larger batteries, um, but he otherwise doesn't get what we need for resource collection. He gets a lot of stuff, but he, you notice he doesn't start with any fuel cells. So it's not like any of his drones can actually do anything. So we're just going to go ahead and start with the heavyweight, because the two guys after that, I, I'm a scientist researcher, is a pain in the butt. It's an honor to have you aboard. on board. Fasten your seatbelts, we are ready for takeoff. How the way is that? I hope you are um, liking the new camera. Um, and new angle, I've, this is my new camcorder that I've got set up. It's a 4K cam, so for me it's nice because it's also a camcorder. It's something that I'll be able to take with me and, you know, do some fun stuff with. You know, we'll be able to do some of them horror shorts and things. Oh no! That can't be good! That looks like it's a gun. It is a gun! Oh, they shot me in my booty. Why does everything shoot me in my butt? You guys, literally everything shoots me in my butt. Every single video game I play, I get shot in the butt. Anyway. Anyways, you guys. Alright. And I'm sorry I'm not doing a live stream today. I know it's Saturday and I'm supposed to be doing a live stream. Um, for those of you that are watching in the future, um, today is nor Saturdays are normally my live stream day. Um, unfortunately, we had a shift of weather here that really messed me up. Okay, so we got to do Godric, it looks like. Um, we could get some afterburners there or booster rockets and some extra shields. Huh. Hey, let's check this one's out. Now, let's just go ahead and take care of this. This would be, probably be easier. Oh, boy, we get to create our first drone. Okay, so let's go battery bank. Battery. Fuel cell, fuel cell. Fuel cell's there. 
there. Yeah, let's go ahead. And... I always set these to control guys so that we can activate them pretty easily. People okay, want the resource collector. We we'll want the magnet. We definitely want our guns. Set that to space. That's already got a setting. Put our resource tank in here. Go ahead and set the last two batteries into place. Let's see here. Might as well finish putting our guns on there, maybe. Set this real fast. We're gonna go ahead and set our boosters here. Yeah, let's set those out wider. I like those a bit wider. Yada yada yada. I already know you're gonna give me shit. Here, what am I doing? Let's go ahead and get our small thrusters into place. We're turning. that to D, Put that to A, Put that to D. I think I might have misset that one. Oh yeah, I definitely misset that one. Okay, yeah, so that needs to be A. The other one needs to be D. Okay, there we go. Let's see here. Get our last guns into place. We don't really need the plasma shotguns, I don't think, for this. We'll name you... <laughs> Wolf. Wolf type. Yep, 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 we are the wolf type zero. Anyways. I da 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 crash. All right, so here we go. Look how smoothly that works, you guys. I love it. Oh man, that's so smooth. I like how that flies. All right, so here we go. Oops. I like going to space by. All right. Let's get you back over there. So we'll need to open these because we need to find the black box inside the wreckage. So let's get these blasted open. We want to collect that. It's got red gems in it. Let's get the turn on. Come on now. Oh yeah, we got it. We got it, you guys. We got this. I really like this game. This is really, really neat. Now, I did originally, like a long, long time ago, try the um, demo for it when it was still getting ready for its earliest releases. And I really liked it then. And so I figured we would take a return to it now that the full game has been out for a while. And um, I just really wanted to put this one up on the channel for you guys. Um, this is another good one for my friend Blintari to watch. And so, you know, I'm trying to make certain she's got stuff she can watch on my channel too. Because you know, she's my friend and I care about her and she gets motion sickness from the um, first person shooter stuff and the first person based games. So I tried to throw some of these on here that I really, really like. And a lot of times I'm pretty good at it. Gonna have to break you and get out of the way here. Grab this. Any of these metal scraps that we can take care of. There we go. 
All right, let's get this back over to the container. We could already leave the planet if we wanted to, but we do need to collect some more resources. And scrap metal and things are always worth it. Um, if we had come across some golden gems or red gems on the planet that are considered resources, we could have collected gold or gems. Um, but I didn't see any, so... We might get lucky, we might not. But let's keep checking around. Oof, a little bit of lag, so I apologize for that, you guys. Um, I don't normally see too much lag, which you guys know. We got a box over there. Get that out of the way. Not really anything down there, so let's go ahead and keep going. Ooh, nice big piece of scrap. Let's take this. That big old piece makes me unstable. Ugh. Dunk. Come on, circle around, slowbug. There we go. In you go. Alright, let's see what else we can collect while we're out here. I just really love how smooth this drum flies. Like, the game developers for this game have done an amazing job with it. I am so impressed. Oh, looks like we got another... Red Gems box here. Alright, let's go ahead and get back out. There we go. Looking good. Alright, I really like this game a lot, you guys. So this is really, really neat. I'm really glad I got to play this for you guys. Bump. All right, so let's go ahead and head back to the Nimbatus, see what we got, have collected. So we've got our dynamic thrusters, it looks like, and some more small energy shields, that's great. Um, we will complete this next planet, you guys, and I will, because we still need one more mission, destroy the core transmitter. Ooh. Oops. Okay, so let's destroy the core transmitter. We want to send, head over that way. So it looks like it'll give us a resource tank and a drill. Wolf type zero. Go ahead and pull those. Add our additional shields. Hold on. Move these that way. Because we're going to put the um, afterburners on there, guys. So, that is a thing. So, let's get this moved. Don't need the resource tank. and get these moved over a bit. Okay, let's go ahead and put these dynamic thrusters in. The lower activate key will be shift. Increase thrust should be W. Decrease thrust should be S. Again, shift W. S. Okay, so Wolf Type Zero is now set up. Make those W. No, wait, those should probably be shipped, huh?
Wait, wait, hold on. I got a moment. Guys, let me just reconfigure this a moment. Set to B, set to A. <coughs> okay. Take some of these basic blocks for structure. Okay, do I need anything else now? Let's go ahead and go. And once we complete this mission, guys, I will end the video there and we will see you in the next amazing video, I guess. Oh, look at that. The transmitter's right there, too. Okay. Those are going to take me a minute to get used to. I wrecked myself. This is interesting. So that's a thing. I like that. I like that. That's really neat. As small as our drone in disguise, I think I may pull one of the uh, shield generators off of there. It doesn't need a bull. Alright. We got rid of that. Let's go ahead and Get out of the line of fire here. And back to the Nimbot as we go. Alright. Anyhow guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the video there. Thank you so much for joining me today, you guys. We will get to some of these other great planets the next time. And as always, remember that I love your faces. So stay amazing. And as always, guys, we'll see you in the next amazing streamer video. Love you guys. Bye.